Casey, what's the difference between play that Lysade and Lucasite poor PRP? Yeah, they're pretty different. So um, PRP is platelet rich plasma. So you have whole platelets and those whole platelets degranulate growth factors and exosomes over about the first week. So consider it a little bit like a slow release pill if you're talking about uh, growth factors, for example. When it comes to platelet lysate, platelet lysate is where we take platelet-rich plasma and we break open the platelets or we lyse them to get the growth factors out. So they're immediately available and consider that like an immediate release pill. Now, functionally, there's a difference. Uh, platelet-rich plasma is a little bit more pro-inflammatory and platelet lysate tends to be anti-inflammatory out of the gate. So you can use leukocyte poor, meaning amber PRP around nerves, like in a carpal tunnel injection, for example. Um, and it will cause some amount of flare up before the patient gets better. If I were to do that with platelet lysate, it would be anti-inflammatory. So it would be much better results out of the gate. Now, whether or not there's a long-term difference in results between the two around nerves, I don't think anyone has studied yet, but it's an interesting question.